Okay. Oh, oh, what the f are you doing here? I'm okay. We're trying to find out what's primal and what's <laughs> subprimal. Hey, uh, do you live here? Yes, I do. Dude, yeah. it's, it's great to find me too. People have been wanting to collab forever, so. <laughs> you know, uh, somebody showed me a video when you said, hey, um, I'll pay my own way. You come to, I'll go to your house. And if, and if any of this stuff is true, if you really sleep on the wood, if you really eat this way, if you, I'll, I'll retract all my other videos. And I'm like, why would I want him to retract the videos? He's talking about liver king. By the way, I want you to meet the queen. This is Kim KO. Of course, of course. And then where, where, where are the liver boys at? Strike saw, a ride. I saw him back there, bro. I can spot yourself. Get your ass over here. <laughs> Kenny KO right here. Say hi to the guy. Nice to meet you. The young prodigy. So you guys on trend as well? Or no? Yeah. No, I'm <laughs> you know, we say it all the time. It's not even a joke. Their friends so. are over and we get water, right? And I'm like, uh -huh. hey, you guys know what's in the water? Steroids, of course. Right. Right. You well, know, peptides. It, it, it's always just a metaphor. If you do these things, you'll express a higher, most dominant form and you're going to kick ass in fucking life. And then what's king? Liver? <laughs> guys, he said what's king? No, wait, wait. Liver what's is king. king. So. Two, two main questions that the people want to know. Do you have ab surgery? <laughs> ab implants. We're, we're, we're on a podcast last night, and some guy said, oh, um, somebody really intelligent said something about ab etching. He denied right. the implants, but he said you probably got ab etching. Like, wait, wait, oh, no, okay. Is this you re relaxed? So, so here's the thing. I, I'm, I'm going to tell you. Okay. I've been flexing my abs for so many fucking years when I take my shirt off. Here, wait. For, for me, me turn off all the camera. Let me see. <laughs> un unflex. And okay. I can tell people if it's ab etching or not. And, and, and I could actually almost sleep. If you're almost programmed with your abs to be a little bit flexed. If they're the same unflexed, then we have oh, a little bit of a situation. This is, dude, okay. No, let me just tell you this. <laughs> I, I have, this hair has never seen shampoo. This body doesn't ever. see fucking soap ever. What about when you were Brian? Well, when I was Brian, I didn't have this fucking, this head of hair when I was Brian, right? So the former head of hair had shampoo. Of course, of did all the modern day manicured shit, okay. right? My, here's my point. I get out of bed, I put on the same pair of shorts every day, basically, uh -huh. right? I only wear shoes when I go into the modern world, right? I don't do shit in terms of grooming my, I'm my primal wild free version of myself. You think this guy's going to get plastic surgery? You think this guy's gonna go get liposuction? And, and, and if I were gonna go get liposuction, I'll tell you right now, it wouldn't be on the abs. Get it. On the goddamn fucking love handles that hang over their shorts. And then question number two, natty or not? <laughs> oh my god, this is ridiculous. <laughs> are you kidding me? I thought we were way past that. Yeah. In terms of Liver King, those guys are way past that, right? There's still a vocal minority of 2% that still ask that question, mm -hmm. right? So I'm like, this is sort of irrelevant. It started with the accusation, natty or not. Wait, for the record, the 2%? For, for, for the record, okay. it's natty, right? And, and, and then it turned into ab implants, right? And then it turned into ab etching. And then, I don't know if you heard, it turned into hair implants. I wore, I, 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 wore, heard that one. I wore a hat all the time in the beginning. Right, and and then I and then I took off the hat because nah, I because I got the, the hair implants done, right? <laughs> and, and I don't know if you heard this one, but in 2018 I went to Singapore. Uh -huh. I was the first human to ever have this procedure done, right? I had gene the editing done. Gene. Oh, okay. Yeah. I had gene. I had my myostatin gene modified. Uh -huh. That's the new thing. That I will confirm is true. Everything else Does is. Does anyone a, know that? Is until a, this point? Uh, not, not up until this point. Are you getting down on organs? Probably should be. That's well, probably and, why I'm not king status. Well, this, this is the thing. Say more princess. Would you admit this? Status, liver king. I would never even say that. Okay. If you don't sleep good for three days, what do you think happens to your testosterone? Sleeps, sleeps king. And, and, right and, behind liver. If you eat like shit, mm -hmm. what do you think is going to happen to your testosterone? You're going to have less drive, less determination, lower ho hormones, fucking horrific neurochemistry, right? If you move like shit, your testosterone. Goes. If you shield like shit, keep your phone next to your dick and balls. Your hormones are going to plummet. If you don't get any sun, your hormones are going to plummet. If you bond like shit, if you fight like shit, if your thermal pressures are non-existent, every nine ancestral tenant stacks and compounds and allows you to express an optimal hormone product. Just 50 years ago, we had 50% higher testosterone. And this is in the literature, go look at that, right? And now the modern day man, manicured man is a, is a hollow version of just a guy 50 years ago. If you wanna be on all these fucking PEDs, all you gotta do is these ancestral tenants. That's what I was about to say. So how to combat all of that that you said, just hop on a cycle. Oh, this is my first time ever trying raw liver. Cheers. Cheers, bro. You can actually suffer and keep your fucking ass out of bed. Take liver fucking Are you gonna pass the liver?